there. Uh, Anima, explain to us, if you can, the scope of this pardon for Hunter Biden. I mean, it not only covers his gun and tax evasion cases before his sentencing, by the way, but essentially anything else that he might have done going back to the start of 2014. Hannah, this is the broadest presidential pardon I've ever seen, maybe going back to Nixon. You're right, Nixon. it covers the Delaware gun case, the California tax case, but other potential investigations into Hunter Biden, the business dealings in Ukraine, the potential FARA violations, the drug use, the prostitution. And, you know, one thing I'll say is I think this was the plan the entire time. I don't believe the president for a second that he changed his mind. And this is why, Kena, no lawyer, and Hunter Biden is a lawyer, Joe Biden is a lawyer, goes and gives up a diversion deal in federal court. That's a gift. No lawyer pleads guilty to all the counts in an indictment without a plea agreement on the day of trial. They negotiate something, a reduction on the charges, a reduced sentence. That leads me to believe that the entire time Hunter Biden had a pardon lined up. Otherwise, he would not have acted the way he did in his criminal cases. Oh, really? So are, are you suggesting that perhaps when we heard from the president over and over and over again that he would not pardon his son, are you suggesting perhaps that wasn't exactly truthful? That was a lie at worst or misleading at best. There's no doubt in my mind that Hunter Biden knew he was going to get pardoned. Otherwise, he would not have walked into that Los Angeles court on the day of trial when the jurors are there and not asked the prosecution for some sort of deal dropping some of the charges, a reduction in the recommended sentence. No one pleads to the sheet, pleads open to the indictment, accepts all the charges unless they have a pardon lined up. There's no reason why any criminal defendant would act the way that he did. Same thing with a diversion deal, Kena. I put more than 1,000 people in federal prison. I never once gave a diversion deal. That's a gift. No one blows up that type of offer unless they have something better lined up. Oh, that is a really uh, interesting thought there, Nima. Uh, Nima, thank you for being here with us today, and Alex, you as well.